Wang was initially prevented from returning to Beijing. That's after he was released from prison earlier this month following a several-year sentence for a so-called crime of state subversion. But he was finally driven home on Monday, arriving just before 8 o'clock p.m. local time. That's according to what his wife posted on Twitter. How many times have I imagined this moment, this scene? I feel like I'm dreaming. Lee has been tirelessly campaigning for his release since he went missing. Her efforts include staging a 62-mile march from Beijing to Tianjin, shaving her head to protest his treatment, and filing almost weekly petitions to the Supreme People's Court. Before his arrest, Wang had taken cases deemed sensitive by authorities, like accusations of police torture or defending members of the banned Falun Gong spiritual meditation practice. He was sentenced to four and a half years in prison for state subversion back in January 2015.